Well, at least I got something useful out of her after being lied to for a very long time. I guess. <laughs> I, I, I enjoy how salty you are about her. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like most of the characters, you know? W. If it ain't gumshoe. Police Department, Criminal Affairs. Or the AI. Hello everyone and welcome back to 4Pixels. Coco is here with Buttons, Branding, and Jamie and we are continuing Ace Attorney, Phoenix Wright. Oh hey, better go look at me! Um, yes. Excuse me? <laughs> that legendary pair was the reason we were able to keep up our investigation. That's why we were so shocked over how it turned out. You mean, with the forging of the evidence? Don't get me wrong. Joe Dark got what he deserved. Still, it was obvious the evidence produced the... Pr it was a uh, black fuck. <laughs> Emma! Er, <laughs> Star! Er, <laughs> Emma St Wait, same person? Now we have problems. Do, 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 do. Still, it was obvious the evidence produced in court was being manipulated. Items our team never found would suddenly appear while other items were kept secret. But you didn't have proof anything illegal was done. I'm proof enough of what happened. After that case, all of us at Goodman were relieved of our duties. Most without even so much as an explanation. Then, Lana Sky transferred to the prosecutor's office and became chief prosecutor. Whoa. Lana always wanted to be a prosecutor. Nothing's quite as simple as it appears. Huh? Lana Sky was merely being used as a pawn. That's my take on the matter. She was being used? <laughs> Damon Gant and Lana Sky. Two years ago, Gant was chief detective and Lana second in command. They were the best. They solved all kinds of cases together, didn't they? Damon Gant's magnetism in particular was almost unreal. His magnetism? By what I mean, his ability to attract evidence. He'd produce the most incredible evidence in the cases he handled. Incredible evidence? You mean... Oh, yes. There were rumors about him even back then. No one dared confront him, though. I'll take it she's talking about forged evidence. Back then, everyone looked up to Lana. All the detectives wanted to be like her. Oh, really? Oh, yes. Myself included. I was a fool, really. She hated anything crooked and always watched out for the other detectives. 
That's why she was so concerned for Jake. Mr. Marshall. When Jake's brother was murdered, she felt as if she had lost her own brother. If it wasn't for her, I don't think Jake would have ever recovered from his shock. That's what makes it all the more infuriating. Miss Dar. That's why. I'll never be able to forgive her. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. Why did she turn cold after that? Lana transferred to the prosecutor's office two years ago, didn't she? Is someone okay? Sorry, there's a mosquito in here and I caught him, but I didn't kill him. Uh oh. Get wrecked, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> yes, thanks to Chief Gant's powerful influence. Chief. Who? That's right. Having solved the S slime case, this position as chief was secured. Amazing. There was only one thing left for him to control, and then no one could stand in his way. The prosecutor's office. What? You mean... That's why Lana was transferred? If he could control the chief prosecutor, he could control the prosecutor's office. That must have been his goal all along. But how could he control Lana? I don't know, but one thing's for sure. Ever since that case ended, she's never been the same. It's only logical to conclude. There must have been a reason for her change. At last. I'm finally getting close to the bottom of this ugly mess. Thank you, Miss Star. You listen to me, rookie. It takes more than just ingredients to create a fine cuisine. I hope you turn out to be a better chef than I've been. Well, at least we got something useful out of her after being lied to for a very long time. I guess. <laughs> I, I, I enjoy how salty you are about her. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like most of the characters, you know? W if it ain't gumshoe. Police Department, <laughs> Criminal Affairs. Or the AI. Oh, you're back. You're still here? I gotta make 150 copies of these files. Brewing coffee, copying files. I'm turning into a regular DJ! Um. You're a DJ as well? Wiki wiki woo. If I'm not mistaken, I think he means desk jockey. Oh. Oh, that DJ. I, I gotta admire your persistency, uh, but my answer's still no. What about this delicious meal? Yeah, okay. I'm not letting you in the che uh, sh chef's office, period. <laughs> It'd be my neck on the line. Sounds like somebody's hungry. Always. That <laughs> office is the last crime scene in the Slon Island incident. I have to take a look in there. Gotta. I have to do it. Phoenix, just grab a chair and throw it through the window. God. I thought that's actually what she said for just a second. <laughs> There's got to be something we can do to make the detective change his mind.
do we actually gotta bribe this poor guy? What's this crumbled up piece of paper? No, hold on. No, no way! Mr. Ashworth can't be serious! Is he ever not serious? I can't believe they pushed him this far. Mr. Edgeworth really feels responsible. At first I thought he was as cold as ice. But now I know different. He trusted us detectives to provide him with sound evidence. But we just... We betrayed him. Detective. Hmm. That's it. I've made up my mind. But... He had to take my ID card. We can't do that. If someone found out... They wouldn't let you off the hook with just another lost item report. Look at me, it's no secret I'm already out of the loop. After all, I'm friends with Edgeworth. Mr. Edgeworth. Depending on how this case, uh, how this case turns out, I may already be as good as terminated. What? So at least let me do this. For Mr. Edgeworth's sake. Alright, Detective. Thank you. <laughs> He's so proud of himself. He's sticking it to the man for justice. February He's a good boy. 24, Police Department Chief's Office. Dun dun. Dun dun. <laughs> Da, 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 da. Here goes, Mr. Wright. Clack, bye. <laughs> Welcome home, Mr. Giant. When did that dust get there? Has that been there? It's been there, yeah. It was just blocked off by a large swimmy boy. <laughs> <laughs> Who would win? Years and years of criminal and legal law, or one swimmy boy? <laughs> I hope someone someone needs to use that as like a journal name. <laughs> Large oh, swimmy boy. <laughs> <laughs> if anyone finds us now, we're fucked. Detective Gumshoe's a goner. That's how it's like. Oh shit! Oh, that happens. Uh, I'm counting on you all to bail me out. What's up? Also, I'm here. Ah! This is going great. <laughs> Sorry, I, I thought you were a ghost. A scientific ghost. I didn't even know you could slap a ghost. <laughs> she slapped Aww. a commotion? Wait. No. <laughs> now Phoenix is smoked. Ah, Detective Gumshoe. Oh, please. Stop Why slapping me! Sneaking up on us like that! I I wasn't sneaking. I was just worried something might go wrong. Also, I've been here the entire time, so I came too. He's helping. If you're here, then what's the point in giving us your ID card? <laughs> Inventory management. Crumpled Golden Shoes ID card in his pocket. What? Hey, don't do that to my card! <laughs> It's laminated! How did you even do that? <laughs> These fucking caterpillars. I hardly ever get a chance to come in here. So I figured I'd have a look around myself. Besides, we're all in this together now. You really do want to get fired, don't you? Not if we're lucky. Now come on, let's see what we can find out. I've got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> I'm being a bad boy. <laughs> that desk on the other side of the room. Was that your sister's? Yes. 
That's where I was waiting for Lana. This egotistical ass couldn't yep. even give her, Lana, like, half of the room for real. He has to put his giant ass fucking pipe organ in it. Yep. Right. <laughs> what um, you don't see is uh, next to the door on either side is the giant, like, up and over the door library collection of uh, really, really bad don't show it to Emma manga she, she, she's got a hold of, too. Mm -mm -mm. So they, they share the room. It's just big organ uh, lewd collection. On that day, two years ago, I was reading my sister's collection of bad manga. Don't! Is anyone using it now? No, sir. This is entirely Chief Gad's office now. So why keep the extra desk? Posterity? He practices a strict policy of preserving the crime scene. The fucking catacombs, you know? That's a strange reason to keep it there. He leaves it as a warning to everyone. I I wanted everyone else. He wants us to always be alert. He told us so himself at a New Year's party. Of course, he was pretty intoxicated at the time. He was trying to swim in the punch bowl. I see. <laughs> so ever since Lana left, no one's ever no one ever touches that desk. No one except Chief Gant and the cleaning lady who's here each morning. Then why preserve the fucking evidence? You fucking got me, pal. Still, two years have passed since that incident, and apparently a cleaning lady's been around. There cannot possibly be any clues remaining. That's what go you think. For, go for the three-pointer. Can I, can I ask you something? Sure. How do you get your hair like that? You only Where came here to look around, from? right? Because <laughs> it's one of those Slabombo uh, crime scenes. <laughs> I mean, that's your only reason for coming here, isn't it? Why do you ask? You don't think... Nah, you wouldn't be. No. No, no, there's no way. Never mind. Don't worry about it. Okay. Now then, let's look around a bit more. <laughs> hey, hold on. Not so fast, buddy. Uh-huh. What is it? When someone tells you, don't worry about it, it's supposed to start bothering you, pal. You're really bad at reading flags. You don't just let it go with that. Sorry. You're starting to get on my nerves. Fuck you! <laughs> okay. So what's bothering you, sweetie? The fact that you're like a 13-year-old boy in middle school is, you know, number one. You two don't think. Chief Gant might be a suspect, do you? What? The chief? No. What? What? No! <laughs> yeah. Mr. Wright, what, what do we think of him? You're trying to kill me, aren't you? It's a large swimmy boy. <laughs> Chief Gant. Can we say large swimmy boy? Is that our answer? <laughs> large swimmy boy. So it's finally come to this. <laughs> hmm. What do I think of him? Perhaps it's best I don't divulge my feelings. Yet. There he goes, ignoring me again. God, Phoenix is just not a good person. <laughs> Dick. Like, he ignores people trying to be nice to him, immediately gets pissed off at anyone trying to help him, and has no idea what the fuck is going on at any point in time. So me. <laughs> no, he's worse than you! <laughs> You can see pretty far from 15 stories up. Careful, Emma. Windows open. Boo! Hey. <laughs> uh, at, at first, the chief wanted to use stained glass for the window. That's dramatic. Really? Why didn't he? 
they say he changed his mind because he wouldn't be able to see the view. Oh. Makes sense, I guess. Stained glass or not, it's a huge fucking window. What is that, a Keurig? <laughs> wow, look at the size of Chief Gant's desk! Speaking of that, when we were here earlier... Yeah, it braided his fucking disc. Holy shit, you oh. really can't see the desk! <laughs> yeah! The two big dudes, you can't see shit! Oh, it's you two! Two, two... Chief Gant! 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 He put that paper he was reading in his desk. Yes. No, not that one. That was you currently thinking. What? Oh, fuck, you're right. Yeah, Shit. that wasn't ghost past you. Well, it might as well be with Phoenix. In that I case. wonder what he was reading. Eating, eating, eating. <laughs> <laughs> this looks like a list of evidence used in a case. A list of evidence? We have those? In most cases, the list runs twice as long as this. Bet you've never seen this before. Hey, look at the case name! Huh? The sl Slurpo incident. I wonder what this is doing here. Hold on, detective. What did you just say? I said I'd wonder what... No, no, no. About evidence lists. Normally, they're twice as long. Uh, that's right. I guess there wasn't a lot of evidence. A half-sized list of evidence. Hmm. That list of evidence, it seems too short. Short, short, short. short, short. Most lists run twice as long. Long, long. long. <laughs> what would the other half of the list be doing here? I knew it! The chief must be hiding something about that case. I guess we're assuming it's a half of a, the other half of a list as opposed to just being the same list. It's just a short list. It would appear so. Take we'll just take that. But it Thanks, Gant. What if we can take... Yo, can we try to put that in our pocket? Thank you, organ. Big son of a oh, bitch. shit, that's what's falling off my wall. One second. Uh -oh. <laughs> it's the organ, no! Save big buttons! <laughs> the chief's organ sure is that side to behold. Don't touch it, Gumshoe. Also, he's got a really nice piano. <laughs> <laughs> Zing bop. Buttons die in action. Uh, we might be okay? We'll find out. <coughs> done, done. Uh, yeah. Command what? command strips, they're great. Oh, oh no. Yeah, why you use those? You don't use those for anything that's not, like, really, really light. It is super light, that's the problem. Yeah, you can't depend on those things. Occasionally, we hear him playing it from the Criminal Affairs Department. It's really fucking obnoxious, it's really, really loud. It reverberates for three blocks. That's on the second floor. And this is the 15th! When a detective screws up, the chief calls him to his office. And then they die. It makes him listen to the organ for hours. It's... sociopathic, honestly. What's so bad about that? Music soothes the soul. After that, he eats them. The detective can't hear anything for days except for the ringing in his ears. Yeah, that's... Permanent damage and probably illegal. So it's an instrument of punishment. Literally. But aren't the chief's ears affected? I guess not if he's Satan. <laughs> he never listens to anyone anyway. So yes, he's half deaf. At least. At least. That's besides the point. Or he never takes like He's a swear boy, of course he doesn't. He said, see you later, boy. Is that an Avril Lavigne <laughs> reference? No. Yes. 
<laughs> this was taken on that day two years ago. The day Joe Dark ran out of the questioning room and tried to kill Emma. After receiving his award trophy, Mr. Marshall took a picture here. Then went along with Chief Gant to question Dark. Bet it never knew. <laughs> I bet it never knew he'd be dead just a few hours later. Yeah, most people don't. Gee, you think? Yeah. This was Lana's desk. It sure is tidy. Lana's always been a meticu meticulous cleaner. There's not even any dust on it. Looks like someone's still keeping it clean. Yeah, cleaning lady. Does Lana ever come back here? No. Chief Gant must still keep it clean in memory of the partnership. They were the stuff of legends are made of. Does he keep it in memory of her, or a memory of the crime? His best moment. These shelves are mostly empty. Lana must have cleaned them out when she transferred over to the prosecutor's office. Took all of her nudie toys. There's a small picture frame on the left shelf. That's what I get. Just... <sighs> <laughs> hey! Listen. This is when Lon and I went to the theme park. Oh, oh no. It was cute for like a second, then really sad. Uh. This is a safe, isn't it? Let's bust it open. Safe. That word's ripe with intrigue. Uh, okay. If you say so. It looks like a code needs to be entered into this panel to open it. Oh, please let us just fucking try. A seven digit number. I think I just might know what it is. Seven, 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 seven. Do you know what it is? One, two, three, four, five. I have a hunch. Oh, I know. You want to try my birth date? It's. Oh, that's. <laughs> I have a better idea. Here goes nothing. All right, so it's either seven, 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 or it's Goodman's ID. <laughs> What a shitty fucking code. Like, I get the correlation, but... Alright, we're just gonna steal from him, huh? Um, Bingo. yes. What number did you enter? Whose birthday was that, pal? God? Seven, seven, seven. Seven, 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 seven. The final ID card number on that record. And with that, we will end this episode right here. Thank you guys for joining us, and see you next time. Bye! Bye! Fun books. She does! What idea do you have? That's, See those cards down there? Yeah. Red one's yours, I'll be blue. We throw bricks. Whoever breaks all the windows for their car, wins. Are you kidding me? I'm like the brick master. <laughs> right. Loser has to answer a question. No sarcasm. <laughs> what is this, truth or truth? All right, fool, you're on. Come on. Wrong card, genius. Oh, whoops.